Queensland will soon have some of the most relaxed drug laws in Australia. The Palaszczuk government has passed plans to reduce its tough stance on hard drug possession. Lauren Forbes joins us from the Gold Coast. Lauren, what exactly will it mean for offenders? Queenslanders will be given three chances if they're, if they're caught carrying a small amount of cocaine, heroin or ice before facing criminal charges after law passed in Parliament late last night. Under the change, police will issue a warning for first-time drug possession. People will get three chances to take up a mandatory drug diversion program, but anyone caught a fourth time will end up in court. Doctors, police and drug reform advocates are welcoming the reforms, but the legislation did not pass without opposition, with the deputy opposition leader voicing his concern. Take a listen. What has the Palaszczuk Labor government done in eight years? What diversion programs have they put in place? What facilities have they built dealing with mental health issues, drug diversions, drug addiction? They haven't. They have completely failed in this space. And now what they're doing is just putting up the white flag and letting more drugs in our community. Those caught car car carrying cannabis under the previous program were diverted from the criminal justice system, but this will now also apply to ice, cocaine, heroin, fentanyl, ketamine and steroids. Thanks, Tom.